What's up, your boy Jay here. Welcome back. I have another prediction video. We got SummerSlam coming up this weekend. I like to predict the card. Let's get into it. So my predictions are not in the order that the matches are in. So this is everything I got offline. Um, first off, let me know down in the comments what your prediction for SummerSlam is this weekend. So match number one, I have Liv Morgan versus Ronda Rousey for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Look, Ronda Rousey is great, but I want Liv Morgan to win. So I got Liv for the win on this one. Now, potentially, the match of the year, the year, match of the night, I should say, potentially, Usos versus the Street Profits. Now, Money in the Bank, these two teams killed it. Um, I don't see the Profits losing again. Like, they... They fought the Usos so many times. Usos has been champion for more than a year. So I'm going to go with the Profits on this one. Um, if they don't win, then I'm, I'm, there might be a turn. We don't know. kind of forgot about this one um, because Theory's been like beefing with everybody that he's going to fight Lashley, and I think it's for the U.S. championship. I got Lashley for the win. Um, I think they're going to try to focus Theory on trying to cash in on Roman. But we'll see. But I got Lashley on this one. The next one is the Mysterios versus the Judgment Day. Look, I'm a big fan of all three members of the Judgment Day. But as soon as Edge left, I feel like they fumbled the ball hard on this team. So, I mean, with Ray Mysterio just winning um, on Monday, I'm going to go with the Mysterios because I feel like Edge is going to make a big return um, to feud with the Judgment Day. We'll see, but I got the Mysterios on this one. Now this one, Seth frickin' Rollins versus Riddle. Now I'm going to tell you right now, this might be it. This might be the match of the night. Um, I don't know. I the, Seth has been losing a lot, um, but again, that's not going to affect his character. I feel like Riddle needs this victory, but this is going to be a tough one for me, but I'm going to go with Seth Rollins on this one. Um, I just feel like he needs to he needs to win. Uh, Happy Corbin versus Pat McAfee. I'm going to pick Pat McAfee. Um, he's been rocking it, so nothing on that. Logan Paul versus The Miz. If The Miz wins, I'll be surprised, but I'm going to go with Logan Paul on this one. And then we got Becky versus Bianca. Now, one of two ways I think can, this can go, right? Uh, last year with SummerSlam, we know what happened. This year with uh, with WrestleMania, kill over match. And these two have been feuding hard. Um, I see Bianca winning. I'd be surprised if they do like a short match like they did last year, like a year in the making, kind of having Bianca get that, that quick victory. But I got Bianca on this one. Um, Becky's good fodder for her, um, but we'll see. So Bianca for this one. Now, Roman Reigns versus Brock Lesnar, last man standing match. So this is where last man standing matches, as you know, they beat the hell out of each other. So I got Roman winning, but then I got Theory cashing in. I don't know why I feel that. I feel like whoever loses this match, Theory's going to cash in on them. Now, obviously one of two things. Theory can just out outright win it or get demolished because it's Roman or Brock. But I'm going Roman and then I'm going Theory cashing in. I feel like the Bloodline may lose both championships at SummerSlam. Could be wrong, but I definitely got Roman winning. Um, I could be off about Theory. Again, it's just in my opinion. Whatever. Um, again, let me know down in the comments who you think are going to win all these matches. Are you excited for SummerSlam? Reports are this that WWE is not happy with the card. I think the card's pretty solid. So, and with everything under the new regime, TV 14, Triple H, head of creative, Stephanie McMahon, you know, co-CEO. I think we're going in, in a good direction. Keep an open mind. Thank you so much for being here. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Follow your boy. Tell your friends about me. And like always, see you in the next one.